SEAL Team Season 6 trailer reveals big surprises. Now, if you guys don't remember, we covered a story about how SEAL Team Season 5 was relying on crowdfunding to make it back to Paramount+. Plus. And, uh, and they did. They made it. And now they're on Season 6. And so uh, I feel like it was our coverage of that show that made it survive. SEAL Team. It's an interesting show. I've watched a little bit of it. The thing with SEAL Team and... And with most military shows, by the way, it'll never be as good as The Unit. The Unit is the best special operations episodic TV series of all time. Uh, they gave it a pretty raw ending. It needed one more season, but but uh, that's my pick. Top, top best special forces military show was The Unit. Uh, tell me, tell me I'm wrong in the comments I'm, and what's better. SEAL Team. The long-running military drama that moved from CBS to Paramount Plus last season now has a release date for season six. And it's coming up fast. The show returns September 18th for a 10-episode run. Last season left us on a cliffhanger. The team was ambushed on a secret mission to Mali. And the new trailer answers a few questions. One of the problems with these shows is that the SEAL team guys in the show, the idea is like they're the only SEALs in the Navy in the world, in fact. And so every mission, every day, they have to go on it. You know what I mean? Like, it's it's very detached from any sort of like actual what it would be like to be in the SEAL teams. It's not really accurate. Even if they get tactics right, even if they get personalities right, it's really not accurate. But they do have a new trailer. Let's jump over and react to the trailer for season six of SEAL Team. Whoa. I know we have lots of questions. It's how we deal after we're knocked down that makes us bravo. I know. If this is how I go, you're the one I want looking over there. The Navy destroyer USS Crampton was hit yesterday. 20 sailors were killed in the attack. That's not good. Bravo will be deploying on a long-term special activities op. Not in Syria, who's there? Who Syria. It? Command's under pressure. One team is going to get decommissioned. Our first op without what? Clay could be our last op ever. Bravo will be the only Americans in North Syria. Show up for war and a Hello Kitty convention breaks out. My soldiers may not be oh, no. but they are feared. Fear. You mean there's chicks? We can work with that. <laughs> I made a bad call. Clay's fighting for his life right now because of me. We're still family. It doesn't change. When did Bravo become a bomb magnet? We never discuss what doing this together looks like. Maybe we should now. Somebody messed up and they need to be held accountable. Why are you not telling me? We cannot keep killing our way out of this war. Jeez! Maybe a little mercy goes a long way. No mercy. No mercy for sure. Come on. No mercy. Interesting. Interesting. I love, like, okay, let, there's a couple things to unpack here. First off, let me go back over here. First off, uh, hilarious that the one guy's like, women, women in combat, we're going to shoot your gun. Your boobie's going to shake all around. I can't go to combat with no ladies. Come on. That's uh obviously i mean it's based in reality like there are women fighters in the middle east and syria for sure who fight fiercely and there's females who fight fiercely in the united states but i i, I see where they're going to go with this like the dumb jock seal can't get used to working with women and he has to like change and see them as you know fierce warriors okay got it cool it's on on pace can we talk about they said the navy's going to decommission a seal team now that is uh, the stretch that is the stretch. They're like, all right, guys, budget's, uh, budget's cracking down. We're going to have to get rid of a SEAL team or two. You have to get rid of a couple SEAL teams over here, you guys. We, uh, we got a few too many. And uh, one thing we need less of 
our most elite special operations forces. We definitely are going to have to decommission. So while, by the way, SEAL Team, uh, what are they, like SEAL Team 7 or something like that? By the way, guys, SEAL Team 7 only has 15 SEALs uh, in the whole team. So you got, we're going to deploy SEAL Team 7 and all 15 of you guys. And while you're over there, we might decommission your command. So, uh, and then when that, when that happens, it just happens instantly. There's no paperwork or anything like that. You guys don't have to turn any gear or anything. You just decommission. Uh, that's how it works. Like that, there's going to be some real pretend out here. Some real pretend. But could it be cool? Could it be really cool? Yeah, it could. It could. It could. So it says here, Clay Spencer, the seal that was shot in the beginning in that ambush in Mali, is alive. He's kicking. Will he survive the whole season? Uh, we don't know. We don't know. But it says here, uh, you know, there's some more mystery to go with. Um, what are you not telling me? Seems like a lot of people are showing up to deliver bad news. Could this be SEAL Team 6's, or I mean SEAL Team's, Biggest season yet with season six right around the corner. And are you guys excited to watch it? Do you guys like the show SEAL Team? Let me know. I'm curious. I think it's it's okay. You got to, you know, you got to give it some grace, I guess. You got to give it some grace. I guess that's the deal with any any of these things. You got to just be like, okay, I know you're trying to do the right thing and make a cool show. Um, we'll let you go. Let me know what you guys think about that in the comments. What's up, guys? Thanks for watching that video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, go ahead and hit that subscribe button up in the corner here and check out this next video. If you want, in the description down below, there's links where you can get Scuttlebutt Show merch and find out how you can support the channel. I really appreciate it, and I look forward to talking to you guys very soon.